So yeah guys, I think it's time for a mailbag video. One, two, three, test, test, one, two, three, test, test, one, two, three, four, test, test, one, two, one, two, test, test. And guys, this is the way how my day off is started today. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. I hope you don't mind how I start this video. Please let me know in the comment below what do you think about it. Long time I didn't make any mailbag video, so I'm so excited to see what are inside of that parcels. Without further ado, let's jump to my working bench and start open all these parcels okay guys so let's start open all these parcels so how we're gonna start with this sd card for my dslr camera because i understand and i was doing some research and i understand if i using a high speed sd card it will gonna increase my quality of the video so i'm gonna do like that because I don't find corner. So here is a Scandex with 150 megabytes per second, 128 gigabytes memory for my DSLR camera. So I'm going to see how it's going to work. So definitely should work better than what I have in the, in the camera right now. So first thing, let's see if there is any description should be behind on the other one, but I cannot read it properly. So let's just open and see what's inside. Okay, look something familiar, there's also a camera over there, so let's have a look what is inside. Okay, so we have a camera. And we have an ESP32 cam. Mm. Yes, so I buy this one because I want to do some experiments, some uh, web server cams and something like that. So I really find it cheap. I'm going to put the links for all these items in, on the description below. So I want to experiment uh, some uh, IoT with the camera and uh, i might want to build a web server camera and i can uh, control anywhere in the world via internet this and i can see through this camera through my mobile so stay tuned subscribe activate notification bell because uh, we're gonna see really a nice project with this uh, item
Okay, so let's have a look from where I buy this uh, item. So this item I buy it from AliExpress. So you can see I pay on four pounds and forty-three pence. I order it on twenty-first July, and they come today on third August. So very fast moving, very fast shipping, and four pounds forty-three is it's really cheap for a ESP thirty-two with a camera. So let's see if they might still selling this item. So you can see. The seller selling also an antenna, a separate antenna if you might want. I buy just the ESP Plus camera, which is costing £3.72 and a shipping you can choose from here. The cheapest one, which is this one, 0.41 pence or oh, free shipping. I uh, choose the 0.41 because it's come a bit more faster than just really without any shipping. Next one in is coming from UK because it's Royal Mail doesn't say what is let's just open and see what is some invoice and some stuff inside the parcel so empty so here we go with some uh, eight deep uh, IC sockets it's just because uh, I'm planning to do some project with some uh, op amps and uh, I want to have uh, the sockets like that I can uh, swap between op amps to understand which one it will gonna be uh, better for the project that uh, I'm planning to do. So yeah, stay tuned. Please subscribe, activate the notification bell to don't miss also this project. I don't want to say what is because I will gonna spoil the surprise so it will gonna be a surprise just I can say that I'm gonna work with some op amps so that's why I need this one to test them and when I get everything nice and the best performance from the project that I am planning to do then I'm gonna eliminate the, the socket I'm gonna design a PCB board and I'm gonna use straight away the op amps so let's see from where I buy and how much I pay on those uh, sockets okay so these uh, eight deep sockets I buy it from uh, eBay from a UK seller. I pay on just £1.90 with shipping included and there is 10 pieces of them. It was a good deal. I really need them for this project that I'm planning to do. So if you want to buy, link in the description below. Okay, so let's see now the next item in. Next item in come from China as well doesn't say a description should be in the other uh, label underneath of this one as you can see there is another label over here let's have a look what's inside yeah so there are some uh, various tips for my soldering uh, station for the katsu and they claim that are really a good quality better quality than the standard ones that i had i'm gonna might see when i will gonna try them to see how they work so i have really tiny ones for some smds so in total i have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten models each are for this uh, iron tip so let's have a look if they are going to work well with this one so let's try a standard one that i can use with more also with some so let's see with this one and if i put this one in they should be all right yeah so i'm gonna see on the next project when i need to solder how they work so now let's see from where i buy and how much i pay on this uh, soldering iron tip okay so these uh, items come from uh, aliexpress so if you can see here 10 pieces lead free soldering iron tips 900m 900m they are claiming that they are better than the other normal ones and as you can see i pay just uh, four pounds and 14 pence with shipping included i ordered them as, as well 21st july and they move really fast they come also today on 3rd august so let's see if the sellers still have them and i'm gonna put the link on the description below if you might want to buy these items so same with the shipping you can choose here as you can see free shipping there is also free shipping on if you want to choose a free shipping i'm gonna see how they work when i'm gonna start uh, soldering something
Okay, so let's come with the next one in. So next one come from eBay, from a UK seller because it's shipped by Royal Mail. So it's quite big. Let's see what is inside. Okay, so so I buy USB Wi-Fi adapter for my uh, old PC because I'm using the old PC now for only programming microcontroller and do some electronic things like schematic and stuff like that. The new computer I'm using more for editing videos because it's more powerful and I always needed to swap the USB Wi-Fi from the new one to the old one to the new one to the old one. I order another one like that I can have also to the other one straight away a uh, Wi-Fi adapter in order to stay connected to the internet in order to not move around because sometimes I have both of them on so I cannot have internet in both of them so in this case, I ordered this one to see how it's working. They claim that it's, uh, it's a bit more faster than the one that I had before. I'm gonna see which one is working better and I'm gonna keep it with the more powerful computer. So let's open this box and see what we have inside. Nothing. So. Here we have the installation guide and manual and how to do all the stuff. I think this is the USB stick where is the, the driver and the software for this one. This is the USB Wi-Fi adapter itself. That's a really big antenna. And I'm gonna try it to see which one is working faster. I'm gonna use the one that I am editing video. I'm uploading the video for on YouTube to be more fast the uploading. It's also a USB 3 as you can see here. So yeah, definitely it's gonna be more faster than what I have before. And I'm gonna use the other one with the old computer like that when I'm doing some microcontroller programming and I need to go to check some libraries and downloads like that. I don't need to swap the USB adapter from the old PC to the new PC and from the new PC to the old PC. Like that I'm gonna have all of them with Wi-Fi adapters. So how I mentioned the item comes from me eBay. It's cost me only £4.99 and it's the USB Wi-Fi adapter 1200M Wi-Fi dongle high speed 802.11 AC 5 dBi dual band. It comes from a UK seller, very fast shipping. I ordered it on 30 July and on 3rd August it's already here so 4 days shipping. Let's have a look if they are still selling this item. So yeah, if uh, they are still selling and as I say you're gonna find the link in the description below of this item as well if you might want to buy one okay so let's come with the last one in this one kind of comes from China but was a drop shipping from UK because it's sended by Trucket 48 uh, it's a Royal Mail Trucket and if you can see the return is here in UK unit 5 Trident Way South Hall and you can see is a trucking number is a UK trucking number so let's see what is in this big chunk to get it some way to don't cut nothing inside here nothing else ah, it's well packed and lots of bubble wrap what we have here some tubes some tubes yeah so i have one two three four tubes then we have some soil moisture sensor soil moisture sensor yeah yeah i remember why i ordered this one then i'm gonna tell you in a minute uh, so four of these ones as well you can see here i have four then we have a four channel relay module. So there is, yeah, four channel relay module with auto coupler. So it's uh, insulated. This one is not soldering properly well. Oh, 
oh, I might can touch a bit with the soldering iron and I can solder very well this one back. Anyway, for channel relay, it will can control these four mini pumps. What I'm planning to do, say, another project that definitely I'm gonna make a video on. So maybe soon we're gonna might go on holiday on Philippines and we're gonna might stay over there for three weeks. So how you can see, my wife, she has lots of plants, a lot of flowers, so she likes to look after the flowers. So for three weeks, we are not in the house. Someone needs to look after the flowers to water them. So I'm gonna might try to make with Arduino a nice project in using these pumps, with using this relay, using this soil moisture sensor to see if it might work to make a program for Arduino in order to keep an eye on these plants when they get a bit dry to start pump some water on and that's why also this one is part for the same plan as long as I am uh, out from the house to keep an eye on that three weeks on my house to see what's happening and what's going on so that's why I want to make this web server camera that I can connect with my mobile whatever I am in the world via internet and to check this uh, my house to see what's going on inside my house so yeah guys stay tuned it will gonna come really nice project soon so this item come from aliexpress and i ordered it on 21st july same so very fast shipping as well so i pay on it 10 pounds and 3 pence with shipping included let's see if the sellers still are selling this item and if you want to buy we're gonna find the link in the description below so the item cost 4 pounds 51 and plus 3 pounds 76 shipping here there is no any free shipping so i choose the cheapest one possible while i was filming this video a courier passed by and bring me another parcel hmm. and this one has also my uh, youtube channel youtube channel on so i'm really curious to see what is inside of this box so let's open guys okay let's get into coming from Mauser, so we have really high quality co uh, components over here. So let's have a look what is here. So we have nice capacitors, yeah, nice capacitors. And I think what is this? So these are this is the order for the Marantz uh, project, the Marantz amplifier. If you don't see the video, I'm going to put it over there, as like that you can watch it. And this stuff uh, is visual that order them. I don't order this stuff because I just gave him the list with the components. Because we decide to change all the capacitor on that uh, amplifier. So I gave him the list with all the capacitor that are inside. And he placed the order and look, the capacitors are here. So this means soon I will gonna come also with the second part of that project. So guys, stay tuned, subscribe, activate the notification bell to don't miss also the second part of that project. So everything is here, all the capacitor for that project, definitely. Yeah, so only capacitor. So these ones, I cannot show you the listing from where they come and how much they costing because as I say, I'm not the one who ordered them is visual for the Marantz amplifier project. And yeah, good that they come like that. I'm gonna have soon also the second part of that video when I'm gonna start repairing and upgrading all the capacitors and try to see how it will gonna work with the new capacitors. So this was the content of the video for today. I hope you enjoy it. Please put a like, share my video, and don't forget to subscribe and activate the notification bell to don't miss my next projects. Until the next video guys, bye bye and stay safe. <music>